My name is Tao Lin. I'm the author of six books of fiction and poetry, and I also like doing art. I started with MS Paint because I didn't have a, a computer, and I used the computers at NYU's library, and they had MS Paint. And then I started using Photoshop when I got a MacBook, like two years ago. And then I think I started doing cardboard cutout, or not cardboard, just like colored paper cutout things. When I started selling my art on my blog, and people would commission me, like, tell me what to draw, like an octopus holding a stuffed octopus or something. I have a forthcoming iPhone app called North American Hamsters, and it's going to be 60 drawings of hamsters. Each hamster will have cooking tips, hunting tips, record height and weight. The first memory I have of drawing hamsters is an ex-girlfriend, when I first met her, she mailed me something. And it was a drawing of a hamster with a thought bubble of a severed arm. And then since that was such a, it made such an impact on me. Not necessarily because it was a hamster, just because of the thought bubble of a severed arm. And because I liked her a lot, I started drawing more hamsters. But I also like hamsters because they're the most minimal animal. Their heads are also their bodies. And then it's just like, it's pretty much just like a face. And I like minimal things. And I also have a thing in my writing where I have characters have neutral facial expressions a lot. And hamsters just naturally have neutral facial expressions all the time. All right, I'm gonna show you how to draw a hamster in my style. You just do a circle, another circle, another circle, two dots in the circle, and a line, and then four lines there, and a tail. And then once you have that, it's already kind of depressed. You can make it extremely depressed by adding that, like it's crying. And then if you want to make it like actively depressed, you add a teardrop. And then from this, you can do something unexpected. <laughs> you can make it so it's actually crying tears of joy. So now it's really happy. I really only care about the face when I draw things. So that's all I care about, really, and all that affects me. So after I draw that, I can make it whatever. Like, this is a, a Sasquatch. For a while, I like just drawing 666 on their forehead. So this thing's fine. But I don't think I would do that in my main work that I put on my website. It seems purposeless. <laughs>